Did you know that some of the most groundbreaking inventions in history were created by women, from life-saving materials? To revolutionary technology, these female inventors have left an indelible mark on the world. Women have made important contributions to the field of invention throughout the course of history, generating groundbreaking inventions and innovations that have contributed to the formation of the world in which we currently reside. Here is a list of 10 mind-blowing facts about prominent female inventors and the inventions that they created. So before starting this video, Please like this video and subscribe to this channel for our future updates. Number 10. Hedy Lamar, Wireless Communication Technology Hedy Lamar was a well-known actress in Hollywood, as well as an inventor during World War. She collaborated on the creation of a radio guidance system for Allied torpedoes. Communication could take place safely and without being disrupted by interference thanks to this method, which was the foundation of the technology. The idea made by Lamar was ahead of its time and was crucial in the development of contemporary wireless communication technologies such as Bluetooth and Wi-Fi. Number 9. Grace Hopper Computer Programming Language Grace Hopper was a computer scientist and a rear admiral in the United States Navy. She is recognized for designing the first compiler, which is a program that converts high-level programming languages into machine code. Hopper served in both roles during her career. Additionally, Hopper was a significant contributor to the creation of COBOL, which was one of the first high-level programming languages to be utilized for business applications. Hopper was a pioneer, not only in the field of programming languages, but also in the field of computer hardware, in addition to her work on programming languages. She is credited with developing the first compiler, which is a program that converts high-level programming languages into machine code. Her work is considered groundbreaking. She was also the first person to create what is known as a debugger, which is a program that searches for and fixes faults in computer code. The contributions that Hopper made to the field of computer science have left an indelible mark on the industry and have been instrumental in facilitating the growth of contemporary computer systems. She was a pioneer for women in science and technology and her legacy continues to encourage women of future generations to seek jobs in subjects related to science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Number 8. Stephanie Korlick Kevlar Stephanie Korlick was an American chemist who is best known for inventing Kevlar, a strong and lightweight synthetic material that is used in a variety of applications, including body armor, helmets, and protective gloves. Korlick's invention of Kevlar was a result of her work at DuPont, where she began her career in the mid-1940s. Her initial assignment was to develop a lightweight and strong fiber that could be used in tires. However, her work took a different direction when she discovered a unique polymer that had extraordinary strength and durability. Cola continued to refine and develop this polymer, which eventually became Kevlar. Kevlar is made from long chains of molecules that are arranged in a parallel pattern, creating a strong, flexible, and lightweight material. The unique structure of Kevlar gives it exceptional strength and durability, making it an ideal material for use in protective gear. Number 7. Marie Curie Radioactivity Marie Curie was a chemist and physicist, but she is most well known for her groundbreaking research in the field of radioactivity. In addition to becoming the first woman to be awarded a Nobel Prize, Marie Sklodowska Curie was also the discoverer of two new elements, polonium and radium. She won the Nobel Prize in Physics in 1903 and the Nobel Prize in Chemistry in 1911. 
The studies that Marie Curie conducted on radioactivity provided the groundwork for a wide variety of medical and scientific uses, including the development of X-ray technology. Number 6. Ruth Handler, Barbie Doll Ruth Handler was an entrepreneur and inventor who, along with her husband Elliot Handler, was instrumental in the establishment of the toy firm Mattel. The Barbie doll, which was first released in 1959 and rose to prominence almost immediately after its introduction, is Handler's most famous creation. The experience of watching her daughter play with paper dolls provided Handler with the idea for the doll. During that time, she recognized a need in the market for a toy that was both more realistic and more inventive for girls. Number 5. Mary Anderson, Windshield Wipers Mary Anderson was an entrepreneur and inventor who received a patent for the first windshield wiper that was actually usable in the year 1903. The invention that Anderson made was a straightforward piece of machinery that consisted of a lever and a rubber blade that moved back and forth over the windshield. Her innovation was ahead of its time because it took several decades for windshield wipers to become a standard feature in automobiles. Her invention was a windshield wiper that could be used to clean the windshield. Number 4. Bessie Blount Griffin, Electronic Feeding Tube Bessie Blount Griffin was a physical therapist as well as an inventor. During World War, she came up with the idea of an electronic feeding tube that was used to treat wounded soldiers. The gadget enabled soldiers who were unable to use their hands to feed themselves by biting down on a tube that released food into their mouths. This was done so that the soldiers could continue to perform their duties. The device that Griffin developed was a significant advancement in the field of assistive technology and laid the path for subsequent developments in this area. Number 3. Ada Lovelace, Computer Programming Ada Lovelace was a writer and mathematician who is credited with designing the first computer algorithm. She is known as the mother of all algorithms. Lovelace collaborated with Charles Babbage on the development of his planned mechanical computer, the analytical engine, and created many programs for the machine, including the first algorithm designed to be processed by a computer. Lovelace is credited with being the first person to use a computer to solve a problem. The work done by Lovelace is credited with laying the groundwork for contemporary computer programming. Number 2. Tabitha Babbitt, Circular Saw Shaker inventor Tabitha Babbitt is credited with developing the circular saw in the early 19th century. She was a member of the Shaker religious sect. As a result of Babbitt's observations regarding the ineffectiveness of the traditional two-man saw used for cutting wood, he came up with a new design that had a circular blade her innovation completely changed the way the lumber business worked, making it more effective and more productive. The circular saw invented by Babbitt is one of the most common saws used in woodworking and other industries today. Number 1. An Tsukamoto Stem Cell Research and Tsukamoto's groundbreaking research has focused on the isolation and characterization of hematopoietic stem cells. She's are a type of stem cell that has the unique ability to develop into all different types of blood cells, including red blood cells, white blood cells, and platelets. This makes them essential for the maintenance of healthy blood and immune systems. Tsukamoto's research has been instrumental in the development of new therapies for diseases such as leukemia and lymphoma. One of the major challenges in treating these diseases is the ability to replace damaged or cancerous blood cells with healthy ones. Stem cell therapies offer a potential solution to this problem, as they have the ability to produce healthy blood cells to replace damaged ones. In addition to her work on hematopoietic stem cells, 
Sukamoto has also made important contributions to the field of neural stem cell research. Neural stem cells have the ability to develop into different types of nerve cells and are essential for the growth and repair of the central nervous system. One of the most significant achievements of Tsukamoto's research has been the development of a new method for isolating and growing hematopoietic stem cells. This method involves the use of a molecule known as Seed34, which is found on the surface of HCs. By using antibodies that bind to C34, Tsukamoto and her team were able to isolate and purify hampol myrase from bone marrow and blood samples. This breakthrough has had significant implications for the development of stem cell therapies, as it has allowed researchers to obtain large quantities of pure ACs for use in clinical trials. Tsukamoto's work has also led to the development of new techniques for growing and manipulating stem cells, which has opened up new avenues for research and therapeutic development. Overall, An Tsukamoto's work on stem cells has had a profound impact on the field of regenerative medicine. Her pioneering research has paved the way for the development of new treatments for a range of diseases and has given hope to countless patients around the world. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.